Hey everyone, welcome to uh, this radio video and uh, notice that there's a lot of uh, high frequency signals uh, today. So uh, I'm going to tune from 25 to 30 megahertz uh, and uh, try to comment what I think or what it could be in, in signals when we hear something. So uh, let's see what we can hear uh, this uh, morning. We're at 1420 UTC on uh, October 18, 2013. So let's see what we can hear on the high frequencies, 25 to 30 megahertz. I don't expect many signals on 25, but starting at 26, I would expect to have much more signals. Put it a little faster. Interesting to see there was a signal here. For those of you uh, who don't know, this is the uh, 11 meter international broadcast band, which is not really used anymore. Looks like an FM signal. There's something here, but it's a little weak. On 26, 28, mostly CB years. Something here. CBRs, probably. This is the start of the uh, CB band, channel 1.
One of the, uh, you could call it international calling frequencies for CB ears. Start of the 10 meter amateur radio band. From uh, 28. 150 to 28 300 lots of uh, CW beacon stations like this one these stations are there to uh, help you see what region of the world you can hear on 10 meters so you can listen to the beacons, check where it comes from, and you know that the path on this frequency to that area is open. Some really great signals this morning. I heard uh, the Netherlands, I heard uh, Finland, heard many, many Europeans on 10 meters.
Sierra Victor. Sierra Victor? Yeah, Whiskey Todd Sierra Victor. You're 5, 9, and 10 for Old Texas. Over. Whiskey 5 Sierra Victor. Whiskey 5 Sierra Victor. QSL. Roger, Roger. Yeah, thank you for the 59. You're a good, strong 59 here also. Many thanks, day 73, Scott Z, all the flies that did. November 5, Victoria Radio. Whiskey Papa, Germany. The 10-meter amateur radio band is one of my favorites because it's uh, usually lower noise than the rest of the band and has great, great signals when it's propagating well. Security X, I call Alpha Israel, Alpha Radio. Okay, one, Mike Radio United, uh, very good afternoon, sir. Thanks for the call, you're 5959, name's Joseph, all right? Starting at um, 29 megahertz, the band changes in the modes for the 10 meter amateur radio band. From 29 to 29.300 or a little less, lots of AM stations. That's interesting. 29, this looks like a, the way the signal actually goes down, it looks like a uh, satellite. I don't know of any satellite on 29035. That's interesting. Really does look like a satellite signal. We hear talking, so it's probably a drift and it's transmitter. Starting at about 29.3, you can say that most of the rest of the signals that you hear, going to hear, are in FM mode here. Nothing much here. And there was the scan from 25 to 30 megahertz. So you see that uh, interesting signals to listen to. I think it's worth it to uh, tune around and see what you can hear during the daytime. Uh, this is mostly a daytime band except for really unusual propagation like a sporadic e-skip that might make this band work um, more into the nighttime sometimes. Uh, I've heard this band open all night with local or uh, even um, you know a few maybe a thousand kilometer away signals with sporadic e. But uh, usually this is mostly a daytime band and winter is probably the best time for propagation. So I hope you enjoyed 73.